Hi Fountain of Health family. I'm going to teach you the easiest recipe. My daughter loves it. It is so easy. Here we have leeks and it's actually my mom made it and it's called, a little weird name, but cockaleeky soup. My da daughter doesn't like that name so we call it cluckaleeky soup. <laughs> okay so all you need is leeks, potatoes, onion, and chicken stock and that is it. So what I'm going to do is cut my, wash my potatoes, so I'm just going to throw them here in the sink, along with my leeks, and this is how you do the leek. You take it and you cut off the end, and this is kind of like a big green onion, and you're just going to cut these off, and then I slice it right down the middle, because what you really want to do is um, get the dirt out of it. So the dirt is going to be, if it's there, it's like right in there and you just want to clean all that out. But I'm going to use all this in the Kalekaliki soup. So I'm going to wash those. Get my, I'm going to do two bulbs of garlic because I'm making an extra batch of soup because um, last time I made it, it was like gone in that day. So um, the reason I make it is my daughter loves it and it's really tasty. Alright, so let me get all this prepared and then we'll saute. So I'm just chopping up the rest of the leaf and then I have them um, just breaking down. I'm, go I'm uh, sauteing them. You see all the ends. You look here in the pan. It's a lot of leaf. And then I'm going to let it cook down just a little bit. I put just a little olive oil in the pan first. Okay, so I'm going to top up my two um, bulbs of garlic and then add that. Just let it bloom, and then I'm going to put in my potatoes and then the chicken stock. Okay, so I chopped up the potatoes, and I probably did six or eight. And then, here at the end, I just decided to leave the garlic whole because I'm just going to uh, blend it up anyway. Alright, so now all we have to do is add, this is chicken stock. So stock is different than broth. It's one cup of stock to one cup of water. So I'm going to add all of this, and then I'm going to add, so this is a um, quart, 32 flu ounces, um, eight cups. So I'm going to add eight, and then um, add eight of water. And then I'm going to bring it to a boil. Cook it 30 minutes and that's it. And then here's the uh, 8 cups of water. Okay, I'm going to turn it up. Bring it to a boil. And um, I can add pepper to it also. Let me just taste it. Yeah, I'm going to add um, salt and pepper to it because the chicken stock doesn't have much uh, salt in it. So here's a teaspoon and then um, pepper. I'm going to do uh, crushed pepper. So about a half a teaspoon. You add half the amount of salt. If I add a teaspoon of salt, I'm going to add half a teaspoon of pepper. All right, we're going to let it bring it to a boil and then let it cook 30 minutes. Okay, let's look at the soup. And here it is, all cooked. And then what I'm going to do, and it's also the potatoes are soft. So what I'm going to do is take my submersible blender and blend it. Looks like when I'm done. Okay, here it is, all nice and creamy. 
well, it's not really creamy, it's more potato-y. And now I put some over here and a little dollop of sour cream because that's what's going to give it that little creaminess. It's going to be so delicious. Mmm. Yummy, yummy. Okay, test, taste test a go go. All right. Mmm, it's delicious. Oh, that is so good. It's so easy and so good, and okay, there you have it. To your health.